Welcome back, everyone, to Faster Than Light. And we are in the abandoned sector. I would like to find a store to repair at. Thank you. Well, let's go ahead and get some scrap before we go to the store, of course. <clears throat> let's not, not let's not get ourselves trapped this time. Okay, so he's got a flak two. I think that is. No, that's just a flak one. Um, so let's get the combat drone out. And let's go ahead and have everything go for the shields. Because we can we can we can ignore that laser. We just need to watch the flak for when to cloak. So we can cloak now. Good shield to down we will not accept surrender <clears throat> uh, now let's get burst laser going for the weapons flat keep going for the shields got him beautiful continue 38 scrap that's nice oh another store um hmm i feel like i feel like this direction's too limiting so we're gonna go this way <clears throat> What do they have for me? Oh, that beam two is tempting. But I have nothing I could sell for it. A boarding drone would be fun too. Oh, a fire drone. That'd be fantastic to have. So once again, we're going to buy something and then only repair a little bit. But that's okay. We're doing okay. Yes. Now, if I could just get like a Zoltan shield, I would be so happy. But honestly, right now... We're okay. We can just spend a lot of points. We just need to fill up our weapons and our drones for what we have now, which isn't too much, and then fill up our weapons and our shields, and I think we'll be okay. Um, may need hacking? Well, no, because the glaive beam will be able to cut through shields, as need be. I th yeah, we'll swing back down and hit that distress beacon. I didn't ignore it. <clears throat> I'm just not doing it yet. Um, okay, what do we need to watch for here? His beam drone won't do any harm, really. Let's get the combat drone out. Uh, do we? Yeah, I guess we. I guess we should hold off on using it. Actually, let's go ahead and get everything going for the shields and cloak whenever he fires. There we go. All right, so we took out our med bay. Not too big of a deal there. All right, so they've got a fire in the shield room, and the shields are down, which is great. Uh, let's have everything else. Let's go for the med bay and the weapons. Uh, continue. Ooh, that's a lot of fuel. We're gonna take it. Very good. All right, so let's get that med bay repaired. I think after this run, I need to go make me some coffee. Throat's all <coughs> flimmy. I'm sure that was really that was really attractive on the mic. I bet. All right, let's do this like Brutus. Uh, yeah, we we are gonna ignore that distress beacon, unfortunately. Continue. Uh, what do I need power from? Oh, med bay. Uh, let's not use the combat drone. Yeah, let's not. We do need to go ahead and cloak, though, because of his hacking coming. So let's just have everything. Uh, let's have this go for weapons and this go for hacking. <clears throat> so hopefully we can get the weapons down a little bit. Maybe knock that missile out. We didn't, but that's okay. Got the hacking down. Let's have everything else go for weapons now. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Oh no, it fired. Here it comes. All right, now the missile's down. We just lost our door system, which is what he hacked. So not really a big deal. Oh, I need to be timing these better. Hold off, hold off. Flak fire, or flak actually go for shields. And now lasers. There we go. Uh, let's go for piloting. Just so we can hit better. All right. We're almost there. <laughs> I guess going for shields would have been the smart thing to do, but, you know. I never claimed to do the smart thing. All right, so let's get the doors repaired and then we'll be ready to move on. Yeah, things are looking good. I actually, I think, I think I would actually like to get a defense drone to replace this combat one drone, even just a defense one drone, because I feel like that would be really beneficial to me. Good, we got a lot of fights along this side. I'm glad I went this way. Continue. Uh, let's not worry about the drone this time. We'll be fine. 
Uh, let's do there and there. And get ready to cloak. Not yet, not yet. Actually, we may not need to at all. Because that's just two shots, isn't it? Yeah, he's not going to do anything to me. Not now. Good. Shields are down a little bit, so we're just going to leave everything on automatic. That's fine. It's all good. Actually, let's have that go for shields now. <clears throat> there we go. Perfect. You know, I don't get scrap weapons enough. It's always depressing. They're so much fun. Hurling junk at people. Although I feel like they should cost you scrap. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like they should be made more powerful, but I think they should cost you scrap. Oh, they want me to give them missiles for scrap. Absolutely. Um, I could ask about the translation device. Oh, I hate to pass that up. Yeah, let's take it. Yay. <clears throat> we got the translation device. Um, and he's good at what? Weapons and engines. Our engines guy sucks. Our weapons guy is good. So engines guy, you're now in the drone room. <clears throat> and Mr. Translator, you're my new engines professional. Which is going to be good. That'll help our uh, evasion quite a bit. Yeah, see, it just jumped up. Yeah, check us out to see. Uh, yeah, let's look for survivors. 26 scrap. Hector's gone. No! No, 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 no. Well, now I need to up the reactor. All right, well, now you're on weapons and you're back on engines. That sucks. Well, at least we got scrap for him. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow in the Rebel Stronghold. Adios. Goodbye.